man and <laughs> it's after eight o'clock and it's like it's freaking dark outside well that doesn't look dark because that's the sun trying to get through those the clouds which are not clouds which are smoke plumes from the cascades started last night with the forest fires up in the eastern Cas in the cascades up by Mount Jefferson and Opal Creek so high winds are blowing all that shit here in, in the valley and we washed our cars last night and then after we wash the cars the ash starts coming in and settling like with a freaking fog bank and woke up this morning to ash on the car and I forgot to video it before I wash my car off with the hose so I'm going to turn you around and you can watch you can see um, Lorena's son's car my girlfriend's son's car alright so you can see his car you can see a bit, you know, his, his car is like black blue too watch they got traffic coming Long truck, go! Oh. You see it? See all the shit in this car? Why is it like that? But, you know, just as bad. that bug on the windshield that's not a bug that's from a rock <laughs> well this is what the ash looks like when the sun trying to peek through yeah so this is in Eugene up on uh, River Road Chambers River See the sun trying to get through. The cat is all so smoky, and the smell is ridiculous. <clears throat> We're just getting a taste of it from Eastern Oregon in the Cascades. So imagine what the people in California has been dealing with the last all summer. This is Western Eugene. My air quality sucks. I smell like a barbecue pit. I was recording all that time, I thought I stopped it. Anyhow, uh, heading west towards the coast. Well, I'm not going to the coast, I'm just going to the next town. But there's a Mapleton fire. Mapleton is like 30 something miles in front of me. And there's supposed to be a Mapleton fire somewhere around there. Hey, a guy on the tracks. Watch out, dude. <laughs> yeah, so. It is not a regular overcast day to shits to the ground. Ridiculous. So. They just closed Mount Pisgah too, the park. They just got emergency tax. There's a lake in there somewhere. They can't see it because the ash is to the fucking lake. getting darker to the north there It's a little 
but up here is the worst. very terrible I mean the color of the sky yeah burnt orange but I mean you're not gonna see it good it doesn't look good it looks pretty pale on the screen the film but trust me it's a lot darker than that It's even darker now. She's not, she's darker now. It's only like 10.30 in the morning. So this is Springfield. See it in the trees. Take it to I-5, so all I-5 is all smoked up too. So we just we just passed Lane Community College. That's it back there. All socked in on 30th. We gotta stop for the train. The train is right there, not moving. Pinche madre. Look. So, why is he going backwards and we can't go forward? My god. About time. Maybe on this road you'll see it better. So, this is West Eugene, even worse than Springfield. as the day go on, 20 to 4 in the afternoon. I uh, just got an emergency text, level 1 fire, wildfire threat is in the Crawfordville Holly area. the ground but it's actually closer than that. Here we go. Lane County level 2 evacuation. I'm up in North Eugene and it's worse up in North Eugene than where it was earlier. 
earlier. So the wind must be chased more to the northwest now. So Lane County just got level two evacuation up by uh, Marcola, which is even closer than Thurston. So anyhow, there you go. East on the skies, look at those skies. Freaking ridiculous. You look at those skies. All right, so we evacuated Eugene going south, and this is what it is now. It's like almost 7.30. It just got dark all of a sudden. We didn't have to evacuate. Uh, Marcola area is, is level three evacuation. So they have to leave now, and Marcola is just a few miles up the road east of Eugene, so. We're just doing a little precautionary voluntary evacuation just in case while the roads are still clear wow it's even got darker now it's darker than what the video is showing Almost as if the sun went down. <laughs> Not possibly, but still daylight on the coast, though. 